of the top players in our PR um, during that season. So, and here we go. We're on Battlefield right now. Seabrick playing Puff. Puff, the most Smash 4 character. Because <laughs> it's just reads and reads. Not, not much technique to it. But a lot of mind games. Yes. Here we go. Seabrick channeling his inner. Oh, up throw. And that's going to do it. And this is why what makes Seabrick so good. That's he knows how to get those setups. He knows how to get those setups. Because if there's anything brawl players do is they know how to work their jank. Yes. <laughs> I'm surprised all the uh, Smash 4 fans are not cheering on Seabrick right now. Eh, they don't care for it. Back air is not going to do it. He's at 113 right now, though. 119. Now, uh, uh, you know, he's, he's done really well versus and a, bear. Yeah. Um, a lot of uh, puffs. Yes. But he is not prone to always winning against good puffs that uh, have good punishes on him. Very true. Um, one comes to mind, I think, if I'm not mistaken, Happy Hydra, who used to be a resident puff main, has beaten poor chops. But Ooh, I could be mistaken. Nice. And up throw rest again. He's gonna do it. He's gonna eat that force smash, but he doesn't care. He's at 72 right now. Smash 4 hype is really killing it right now. Alright, we have two stocks, 0% by both. Back throw. Very interesting. Very nice back air from Pork Chops and the multi shine shield pressure. Okay, laser keeps him in bait. Up tilt, back air. Okay, alright. I see Pork Chops. Up throw. I mean, up air. Pop him up. Oh, great bear. Jiggles is just eating these lasers. Yeah. Which is weird because Jigglypuff has probably the easiest way to light shield. Yeah. Uh, and power shield, I mean. So you can just crouch under them, you know? Cool. Just kind of fo uh, force an approach here on Pork Chops. He's going with these lasers down tilt. Almost gets up thrown into rest, but didn't work out. Right now, Jigglypuff's at 124%. Seabrick doesn't get very many hits on Pork Chops, but let me tell you, Seabrick, when he does get those hits, he, he makes them count. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. His past two stocks were up throws into rests, and you know there's got to be a lot of opportunity to put in that to put them in that setup and to kill. Oh, there you go. Excellent stuff, Pork Chops. Then staying in the middle of battlefield and just shooting lasers, not approaching at all, forcing uh Saber to approach, but gets the read from that up throw on the platform and gets the rest. And now it's one one. And this could be Sabrick's game very easily if he gets another up throw rest. I mean, I could see that, but as you know, Pork Chops is most. I'm pretty sure Pork Chops is like strictly melee, and Seabrick is just dabbling with melee right now. That's just my opinion. I mean, his his issue is the same as uh, Isam. He doesn't have the same pedigree as Isam in melee, but at least in South Florida, he's, he's got the hype. He's yeah, he's not just the hype. He has the know-how. Yeah, he has yes. the mind games. He knows he can win. He knows the setups, you know. True. And that's pretty much what you need. Like, if you, he knows how to adapt. If you can do the, all that and just play it safe, you know. Oh, oh loses all his jumps. jumps. Loses his, all his jumps, say break, frustratingly. Just that was SDs Seabrick off the left side. off purple guy. Very and famous Smash he player. flipped off purple. <laughs> yeah, he's, he flipped off purple guy because he said, no, sarcastically. Yeah. So. Probably not even caring about the result of the match. Really not. This is just pools. Pools is. I could be wrong. Right now. Here we go. Going Dreamland. And what? What did. What did he ban? I would love to. To allow Dreamland. Like. Maybe it was a Battlefield ban? Battlefield? It's very interesting. Like. I would have not given him Dreamland, but uh, I guess he did. Maybe FOD? I guess FOD. What I like about Poor Tops is the fact that he's so laser heavy, you know? Yes. Lasers do put on good damage.
from this angle, uh, Edward Lisanti, aka Purple Guy, looks like Ron, Ron Swanson. Oh, misses the misses the rest punish. Tries to rest out of shield. Try to punish his uh, up uh, down down uh, down air drills, and he just eats that rest. Just eats that rest. Like you were saying, uh, Purple Guy, if he were to shave most of his beard and leave the nice Ron Swanson mustache and style his hair up in a really nice fashion, he could probably pull off Ron Swanson with a nice brown Absolutely. Suit. But he has to keep a straight face and be as quiet and timid as possible. And in my opinion, that is not Purple Guy. Purple Guy is nice, loud, and outgoing. No, he's very cool. He's very funny, though. I've spoken to him many times. And, uh, very cool guy. Oh, nice, excellent stuff. That's the back air. And right now, Porchop's playing the matchup really well. Well, at least I would say not only playing the matchup, but I think he's playing the person really well. Like, yes. he has Seabrick on lockdown. Of his hand. And Seabrick frustrated. I don't think he has found yet a footing after that SD on the last stock on the battlefield. And now he's down two stocks. Seabrick looks really frustrated right now. He's not looking happy. He's like, and I know he's a momentum-based player, yes. so you know, like if he doesn't have the momentum behind him, it's like, a sh you know, a ship in the sea without wind. You know, exactly. Kind of just dead there. Car without gas. Probably out of gas. Okay, nice pound. I notice him. I notice Seabrook going a lot for these aerial movements. In my opinion, relax with the aerial movements because most of the time aerial movements don't help. I like what he was doing before, like picking his spots in between the lasers and yes. just getting uh, his his grabs and the up throw rest. But it seems like Porchop is moving in a way where he can't get these grabs now. You know, yeah. so he has to go for these hard reads that it has cost him actually his stock. You know. Not really working out. Gets the back throw though. And oh, wow, he gets stuck. Now they're 2-2, two, two, but he brings out 130%. And he has these again. Wow. I don't know how that happened. He, I don't know if he just waved Dazzed into death. Like, I don't know. It seems weird. He probably jumped and up. Uh, no, he didn't even jump. He's, no? No. He said, okay, what happened was that push chops comes to pressure him on the left side. Uh -huh. And he just dares. But he doesn't you know, get meteor. He just has these. Like if he air dodged, you know. Yeah. Oh, oh tries to get that read. Couldn't go. He's just trying to get the frame cancels. Okay. Uh, poor top. Oh wow! Excellent. Back oh air to down air. Yes. That works. Right that's that's sick. I really liked it. Unfortunately, so it was a great set from Seabrick. Yeah.